Hello everybody, welcome to Fairhead. Well it's been a long time since I've done a video. I've just had my PC fixed. But we're starting off with 1.5 million. This is uh, the money from my old series called Glen Ethan. So we're starting from scratch. We ain't got no, no land, no vehicles apart from the Land Rover. So we need to go and buy a bit of land. And uh, and then we're going to purchase some vehicles, but I'm not not going to buy no new vehicles. It's going to be all used machinery. So we're going to pl we're playing it two days per month. Um, we're going to have it on times ten when we've got our land and bought some uh, machinery. I don't know what's in the used market, so I'm hoping there's going to be a tractor in there. But well, well, we'll have a look after we've purchased a bit of land. So I'm not going with the starting farm. I'm going to go for a farm just down here. So yeah, uh, I'm running some uh, realistic mods. I'll read them out to you when we get to the um, bit of land I'm going to buy. But they will be in the description down below. So if you don't use them, check them out. Is this it? Yeah, here we are. I've got the mod where we're, uh, we're not no teleporting. Right, this is the bit of land we're gonna buy. Where am I? Down here, I think. So we get we get three fields with it. So that's gonna cost eight hundred and three thousand. So we buy that. So that leaves us with 700. Right, the mods with realistic damage system, exhaust extension, adjustable mirrors, manual detach, re real three point attacher, rain pain, combine experience, manual attach. Oh, they have a manual discharge actually. Manual attach, the mud system, the real dirt particles, the real dirt color mod. Real dirt colours and tracks, real dirt fix, and then we're going with round, round and wrapped round bowels, real mower, dusty land extension, advanced maintenance, no teleport, and GPS. So let's have a look. I'll tell you what, let's jump back in the Land Rover. We'll go back to the store and we'll go back to the store and then we'll go and take a look in the uh, we'll go and take a look what's in the used market hopefully we've got some things we can buy I didn't even take a look what what we had in the fields to be honest we'll have a look when we get back to the uh, get to the store that's the farmers market where you buy and sell animals I think the store's just round here.
Right, let's have a look. So, we got a baler, a planter, a tractor. Well, we're definitely going to have that. on it attaches front attacher what's the front attacher don't know what that is well we'll have a front loader and we'll have GPRS, so that puts that up to 42,000. We'll definitely buy the mower. Yeah, so we're only going to buy stuff out of the uh, used market. Let me have a look, see what we got in the fields. So we own number 20. That's grass. I think we got carrots, no. Red beet. So field 21 red beet. And field 37 grass. Is that nearly ready to harvest? No. a lot of money right let's go back in the stock shop so we're going to buy this baler as well I think because we're we can only buy out of the uh, used market so while it's here we might as well take advantage on it buy that Seeder and a planter. Well, we ain't got the horsepower for them, but we can lease. We can lease and buy stuff, and buy stuff out of the used market. I'm not allowed to buy anything brand new. And that's a mo oh combine. We'll have to buy this as well because we're gonna need one. New pipe. Manual discharge GPRS. That's a hundred and three thousand. So we'll buy that. Um, do we buy these? I think as they're here, I think we should should go with them. What's that do? I don't know what that does. Oh, what's this? I don't know what that is for. Oh, fertiliser. We we'll definitely want that one then, don't we? Oh, that's for that, uh That's for to have the fertiliser at the front, I, I do believe. And then the paper comes along. Yeah, we'll, we'll put that on it. We can rent that, so that's 61,000. And we'll have the cedar as well. I think that's a mulcher. So 
Is this a mulcher? Um, top link high. Power takes. Mowers. Now this can be a mower and a mulcher. Oh, that's not bad. We'll buy it anyway. 21k. We can always sell it in the future. So, yeah. So, I reckon we should... Uh, I don't know if this track is going to be big enough to uh, run this. Maybe I should put a front weight on it. Hydraulic pipe lines. So yeah, because I can't tab, I'll have to get a taxi back to the uh, store. But I'll jump cut. I'll jump cut until I've got everything back to the farm, and then once everything's back, and then I'll come back to you. All right. Everything's back to the uh, yard. We'll put that on times ten. And we'll go and get uh We should have enough power. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna get out of here. We should have enough power. Well, the lawnmower is 80 horsepower and the track was 79, so hopefully it's going to work. I did have to put a front weight on. Is this my field? Is the entrance? Yep. Just make sure. Yeah, this is my field. So I'm hoping we're going to have enough power to... Uh, to do this drop that down turn it on and away we go yeah this is fine hopefully I had to uh, lease a bigger tractor to pick, bring the uh, the cedar and the mulcher back because uh, this tractor was too small. But maybe we may have to lease a bigger tractor to do to do this mowing. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, it's going all right now downhill. It's uphill, it's going to struggle. Uphill, it's going to struggle. So they don't give me confidence that it's going to work the bail and either, so. Yeah, maybe we need to. Um, rent a bigger tractor so we'll go down to here we'll 
full stop just there. Lift that up. PCO off, drop the leads, drop the tractor. We'll take this back to the farm and uh, we'll rent a rent a tractor and probably rent a front mower to go with the um, the back mower. I've got store deliveries on as well, so we'll get it delivered to the farm so we don't have to mess about. But yeah, that's our field of red beet. Again, we're going to need a... So yeah, we're going to rent a big tractor. And then that will... Uh, we'll have that for our... Until we can buy one used. We'll just keep renting it. But this tractor will do a... The windrow. And a tether. Yeah, we'll go back in the farm. Back this over here. All right, we'll put store deliveries here because it's a nice big. And we'll rent a tractor. Um, go with medium. What should we go for? What should we go for? Um, let's go New Holland. I don't use a New Holland usually. But we'll bump it up. going to cost 14,149 then every hour is going to cost 5,000 and then the daily fee is going to be 2,774 I think that says so we'll rent that and uh, we'll lease this That as well. Connect PDO shaft leads. Let's get back to the field. All right, here we are. I've got the uh, realistic cab through as well, so we can uh, lean forward. That should do it there. Jump out. Connect. PTO leads. Nice. Turn the front mower on, drop the back one, and yeah, let's get the mower. Ah, oh, that's better. Right, I'll chuck it on the first time lapse, and uh, we'll get this uh, field done.
All oh, right, this this field nearly finished. I'm gonna go over there and just uh, cut that bit of grass next to that uh, red beet field. We might as well wait. And then I'm gonna do half and half on this field, half silage, half hay, and then the little grass field what we have, what's at the back of the yard. We'll, we'll go and uh, cut that one today. And then uh, I think I should be able to cut this. Yeah. Oh, there's a car there. I didn't see that. But you may as well cut this bit of grass, right? I must own it because if I didn't own it, it'd be telling me that I don't own the land. But this gives us a bit of extra grass, doesn't it? do this as silage anyway just gives us a few more silage barrels I don't know where that gate takes you I'll we'll get this bit of grass here Oh nice, get rid of all these bushes as well. We can put some kind of production just there. Unless we can make the field bigger. But I think that's the access to that field there, so if we can't uh, plough up the uh, track. But we'll get rid of all these bushes. little bit here what I missed and go back alongside the field and then we'll go over the road and cut the other bit of grass and then uh, I don't know to get the tedder and Ted then row after but we need to rent the windrow rent the tether and rent uh, oh maybe I shouldn't have come up here right let's turn these off Might be able to get the windrow up here anyway. Drop this one down. Yeah. Bit bumpy. Perfect. Right. I 
Let's go over the other side. I think this month we're going to be. It's only going to be one day per month because it's the first month. Which way is the best way to go? I'm going to get out of here. Yeah. I think this is the way to that other field. Is it down here? Yeah. We've got another patch there. You gonna go through there? Oh. Is there another gate? into this field this is definitely my field yeah so yeah we can't get in uh can't get in that way that's too tight oh that's a big bump but yeah I've, i don't know what that shed is on the end there and it's got to be some kind of animal shed Yeah, but most of the land on here is all grass. That's going to be a take to get in there, isn't it? Wait, let's open the gate. I think the best way to get in there would be reversing. gates in that wide well we're in <laughs> we're in realism take eat your heart out yeah look at how wide that gate is look I'm not very wide at all right unfold you Unfold you. What's the best way? Right. We'll get this one mode. And I'll uh, speak to you when it's done. Second field nearly finished. So we'll uh, we'll keep hold of this front mower. Well, I have got least to, least to own on here. Um, I don't know if I'm not buying brand new equipment. If I can lease to own, what do you reckon? Let me know in the comments if I can uh, lease to own. Maybe. If I want to lease something, I have to lease it for a year or two years before I can purchase it. But yeah, let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think. B. 
but yeah, I'm not going to use no auto stack trailers. They what teleport them off the ground onto the trailer. I'm not going to use none of them mods. Maybe uh, the actual uh, bow trailer collectors what pick them up, but not the ones what teleport them. So yeah, this gate's really tight. Maybe I should come out, come in this gate, turn around and go in it forwards. Alright, let's see. Yeah, that's really tight. Interesting. Wow. And then can I reverse in this gate? I think we need the uh, lawnmower with the bat bat wings. Now I'm stuck. Right, let's get back to the yard. We'll uh, take these mowers off. Which. This is where I'll put the baler so the mowers can go in there as well. Take the leads off. Drop the PTO. Drop that. I've got the in interactive controllers as well, so when I find a tractor what has them on, we'll, we'll use that. But, uh, come on. This map's quite tight. Quite tight. Right. PTO leads. Right. Got to lower it. That's it. Right, let's see if I can get the baler out now. I think that might be a bit difficult. Connect this up. Connect that up. Switch that off. And we'll go to get the Massey. We can use this one there. Uh... Right, we'll go back to the shop store and uh, we'll uh, rent a tether. Head around the uh, windrow. So yeah, I'll uh, meet you at the uh, store. All right, here we are, coming to the store now. And again, this is a tight old place. All right. Let's uh, run over here and take a look. Right, tethers. Um, I think this 8 metre, 7 metre, 80. Yeah, we'll take this one as 40 horsepower, 8.7. Yeah, this one's good enough. Bump this up a bit as much as we can. At least 816. So, 
We'll uh, reverse up to here. This field nearly finished. We'll take the uh, tractor and the tether over to the other field and then we'll call it a day. And we'll pick it up next time. I say in the next episode will be in September. And we'll get this uh, get this road up and uh, get this bowed. So yeah, if you uh, if you haven't done already, please subscribe, like the video, comment, tell me what you want to see, or what you want me to do, and uh, we'll, we'll see how, how far we can go. So yeah, so I'll take this over to the other, the other grass field, and then I might purchase that other. I have a field next to the uh, red beet field because it has a cropping. Now it fills carrots, and I think the field next to field. What is it? Oh. Field 20, 22. I think that's. Uh, might as well see how much that is there. Field 22. Oh, yeah, we'll just buy it. So field 11's a grass field as well. So we may make that into an arable crop. So yeah, so next time we'll uh, Ted half a quarter of this field. Probably the back end. Maybe this little section here will Ted and then we'll do the rest all this silage. So we'll come in here. I'll put the marker in. Right. So yeah, this we're going to leave it here. We'll uh, we'll do this next time. So thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, please do, and uh, don't forget to like, comment. See you again next time. Bye.